Hello you guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Kylie. And I'm Will. Thank you so much for being here today. Today's video is going to be a lot of wedding stuff, a lot of random like weekend things that I have to get done. Basically today we are going to view our wedding venue again and we're gonna visit a lot of the rehearsal dinner venues. Different options. Yeah. yeah, different options. I mean, we're also considering our venue as an option for the rehearsal dinner. Yeah, we're just going to kind of drive around. We took off of work for half the day. So we're going to just drive around, see some of the places and the options, have ourselves a day full of wedding planning. We're also going with our wedding planner and her intern is coming along today. So it's exciting to meet them. Yeah. I'm excited to bring you guys all along and yeah, let's just get right into it. Yeah. I've been dreaming so much lately about your face when you're smiling. It's the only thing that saves me. Mm -mm. Hey, I don't know if I told you. That I think you're beautiful And how oh, I can't wait to hold you Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down And I don't know what I would do without you Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down We just got done at Lansdowne, which is our wedding venue So we're gonna head over to the first rehearsal dinner selection And see what it looks like and see if we envision ourselves having the rehearsal dinner there. We've seen pictures of it, so we're not quite sure what it actually looks like in person. So we're just gonna go take a look and see what we think. Hey, now look into my eyes. You can use them as a mirror, baby. You're my ticket to paradise. Hey, now everything's all right. We've been longing for each other. We're heading to Top Golf. We didn't set up an appointment with them, so hopefully someone can meet with us. We're just gonna head on in, see if someone's free. Our wedding planner has been talking to them, so hopefully everything goes well. <laughs> just got done for the day we just finished at top golf and i think we really liked it yeah going into it when you think of top golf as a rehearsal dinner venue you're like why you know like that doesn't make any sense yeah you don't really think about having an intimate wedding event there yeah but oh there's a trader joe's right there okay sorry <laughs> after seeing the spaces that they have that you can use and everything like that i think that it would make for a really cool rehearsal dinner really excited to kind of put all of these places on paper and see what we choose hello you guys happy saturday today is a new day and i'm actually getting my hair done so i thought i would bring you guys along i'm not gonna take my camera in but this is what it looks like currently I'm getting it lighter, so I'm excited. I do have before pictures that I took to send them because I wanted to send them my inspiration because I couldn't do like a consultation, but I figured while I'm in Virginia to get my hair done, trying to get it done before the wedding so that I have it done to what I want it to be done and for like all the wedding events, I guess. Wish me luck. I haven't had the best of luck with getting my hair done at like literally any salon, um, so hopefully this one does me well i guess but i'm gonna put my mask on head on in and yeah i'm excited okay and literally five hours later my hair is done i think it looks so good sorry i'm in the car and the sun is literally right in front of me so i don't know if you can really tell what it looks like but i'm obsessed it is so blonde currently eating a fruit cup from chick-fil-a <laughs> I'm sitting in front of the mall. Will dropped this off so that he could go get his brother. He had like a practice or like, I guess it was like a personal training. And Will and I have to go shop for tuxes for him for the wedding. I'm trying to eat lunch really quickly because the last time I ate was like before the hair appointment and we are like on the go today. So 
I'm just trying to balance everything. I got the grilled nuggets and a fruit cup from Chick-fil-A. I'm gonna finish a few more bites. These are like my favorite things in the fruit cup. Head into Nordstrom. Check out some tuxes for this Will. Something that I know for sure. It's just something about you. I just want more. Hello you guys and happy Sunday. I did not vlog pretty much at all yesterday. I got a few things vlogged for you, but you know, yesterday was really busy and so that's okay. But we ended up going to the mall. I think I vlogged in the car before I headed in there. We got a lot done, it felt like, even though we didn't. I don't know. So we went to the mall and we were going to look at tuxes for Will for the wedding and they didn't have anything in his size because he's a tall guy. So we looked at swatches of things and then we ended up going, that was at Nordstrom and then we ended up looking at the perfume counter because Will and I want to get a signature scent for the wedding festivities. So we ended up actually both finding one so I can show you what we got. This is what we got. The lady was so nice. She did the most. She was so patient with us and helped us find exactly what we wanted. All right, I moved you guys back. I have to like spread my legs out, like stretching position almost. So then I'm at like So the you same can fit height. in the frame. This entire like bag smells like wonderful perfume. So this is the one that Will got. Oh, Pasha. De Cartier Edition Noir Sport. It smells really good. It does. And I was trying, when I was um, picking out my cologne, there was like a Dior cologne I wanted to get. It was Dior get. Sauvage. Yeah. I wanted to get that because it was really similar to what I have already uh, for my cologne. But the lady, Michelle, kind of talked us into kind of creating a unique smell for the wedding. Which... Yeah, well I was telling him how that one kind of smelled like what he normally wears. And so that- I... Like clean and fresh. Almost. Yeah, so that I kind of wanted him to get something a little bit more unique. Yeah, so... I would say this is like a little bit more- Unique. Unique to what I But it still do. smells really good. Oh, it smells really good. And then I'm he excited. got a free like sample size one with his. So that was really nice. Woo. I think that was also kind of like the selling point of this one because the Dior one didn't have a travel size. Oh, that's true. Yeah. And then the one that I chose was this. It's Chance Chanel. And then there's like a whole line of Chance Chanel ones, I was told because they were all lined up there. And then this is the Eau Tendre one, Eau de Parfum. I don't know, she was trying to explain it to me. I, I still don't quite understand, but it's kind of like fruity and, but not florally. And it's kind of like flirty and light, Yeah. I would say. I really like it. And then I got also the smaller one because we're going to be traveling. And to kind of explain why we're getting this, so we're gonna, wear these for the like bridal parties, our couple shower. Our wedding events, like bachelor party, just, bachelor. Yeah, event. literally all of our wedding events. And then the also of course the wedding and then honeymoon. our honeymoon. Yep. And then That's after that- we need that, to save the travel. Like I know yeah. we, we are gonna wanna use that one probably, but we should probably yeah. use this one a little bit. Well, they bit. said that you can refill this from this. Oh, that's nice. After the wedding is over and everything like that, we can then wear this scent for like special occasions exactly. or like our anniversary. Yeah. And so I just thought that that was such a good idea and I really liked that. And then this will be like in the photos for like the layouts of everything in like the photos with, it'll be like my perfume, our invitation and everything like that, that our photographer will take pictures of. And I think the bottle is gorgeous. So that was also another selling point for me. Do we want to do something satisfying for them? Pour it out. The samples, Michelle, the lady who was selling the perfumes to us, she was so nice. And she literally told us she's been working there for 23 years and she wants us to come back. She stocked us up on samples of perfume and cologne. So this is what we got. So I am your girl. Oh, I opened this one. I'm your girl if you want to try perfume. 
Okay, so enough about perfume and everything like that. That was kind of just a recap of yesterday. We didn't get everything done yesterday that we needed to get done. So today, we're actually heading back to the mall because we need to work on some registry stuff. We need to do some more suit shopping stuff for Will. So we're actually gonna head to Starbucks now, get some breakfast at Starbucks, and then we'll come back here, regroup, and head out to the mall. Okay, we just got to Crate and Barrel. He's mocking me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna head in and hopefully we find plates and cutlery. We've been slacking on that because we really just want to hold the silverware and see how it feels. And is that what cutlery is? Yeah, like forks, knives, and stuff like that. And we want to see the plates in person. So let's head on in. Tell me what you wanna do right now. Tell me what you wanna do tonight. I really don't care as long as I'm with you Hey, now look into my eyes You can use them as a mirror, baby You're my ticket to paradise Hey, now everything's alright We've been longing for each other at Crate and Barrel. I think it was really productive. Mm -hmm. We saw some new things that we didn't see on the website. We got some new ideas, so that was really fun. And I think it's just a good thing to do as part of the wedding process. This weekend has actually been really fun. Yeah, we planned a lot of different yeah. things. And it's fun. just been, I don't know. And then we still got the tux. Nice. We did yeah, the, I we mean, still the, my favorite part was still doing the perfume. Yeah, the perfume was surprisingly fun. I didn't think that'd be like a fun thing to do with you, but mm -hmm. it was really nice. But we got a little gift from them. We're going to check out what they gave us. They give you like a little gift for registering with them. So we're going to look and see what they gave us. That's the bag. I think it's cute little tote. Yeah. There's a bunch of like just, you know, advertising for them in there. This is like the real gift. Oh, oh it says congrats. That's so cute. Okay. Okay. It's like a little wine glass. Oh my gosh, right? they gave us wine glasses. That's nice. We told them that when we were registering like through Zola is what we've been using, a lot of the things that we found that we were liking were Crate and Barrel. So we were like, we might as well just come to Crate and Barrel and like register through them. So that's what we're doing. All right, we're gonna head to Men's Warehouse. Will's gonna try on some tuxes. Get that over with. Hey. Now look into my eyes You can use them as a mirror You're my ticket to paradise Will and I just got done at Men's Warehouse and we fully customized his tux for the wedding day. I'm so glad we got to do that. Now we're stopping at a place called Santini's to pick up dinner and take home slash lunch because we didn't eat anything. Maybe I can set you up here. We basically just had the breakfast sandwiches since you saw us last and that was it. It's about five o'clock and yeah, we're completely famished. Um, I'm like chugging my water while I sit in the car and it's been a long day. We thought that men's warehouse closed at four. So we were like trying to rush from Crate and Barrel, not like rush through Crate and Barrel, but we wanted to get from there to men's warehouse in time because we thought they closed at four, but they closed at six so we were at men's warehouse from like one to five pretty much so that's kind of crazy but i feel like this weekend was really really productive and i feel like we got a lot done i'm really excited that we got a lot of wedding things done will is going to look amazing in his tux he got it completely customized and i think he's really excited about it i'm just really excited about it because and there's a few little touches that he added that make me like really sentimental and i don't know 
Hello you guys, so it is much later and I changed into my PJs and I'm actually just gonna head to bed. We ate dinner and then we sat on the couch and finished watching Mortgage or Marriage, which is a show on Netflix that we've been watching lately. We just finished it, it's actually pretty good. We've just been liking it for like wedding inspo and stuff like that. So if you're looking for, it's kind of like an HGTV show, then I definitely recommend it. But yeah, we just kind of finished that and now I'm gonna head up to bed. But an exhaust weekend and I'm just gonna get some rest and wake up and work tomorrow so I really hope you guys enjoyed this kind of wedding centered weekend we got a lot done or I think we did if you liked it make sure you give this video a thumbs up make sure you're subscribed make sure you have the post notifications turned on and I will see you guys in my next video bye